this will all right so it says it has come from test.php so this is also very important so this yeah these are the server variables which we have uh, you know which are really important okay so always remember that you know i don't know how you is oh okay there is one more thing uh, yeah remote adr the remote adr so i don't know if i can copy this somewhere or okay what i do is yeah hmm fine that's okay if anybody who's out there who want to test this file yeah you can you can definitely go ahead and do it on your own server to see what this really does okay so this is one file uh, one variable which is really important on the server side which is used to fetch the server parameters what are the parameters on the server side all right any questions here and thanks to uh, you reminded me the spelling is wrong there yeah great so the next is php constants they are like really awesome constants again these are only used for debugging i use them for debugging i don't know what the use how other others use them but i i, I specifically use them to debugging so i'm i'm coming back i close the screen share here so dollar server so dollar server will have all the server information so it is important in getting the server information okay so uh, this is again uh, okay i told you i'll explain you things here okay uh, let me just uh, start the screen share again so which is used when that is what important knowing this is pretty cool anybody can know it because all you got to do is like print it you will know it you see the information on the on the what you call php.net you get it but when to use what now i explain that part so here <coughs> self and script underscore file name is used in form actions for instance if you want to submit the file to the same to the same file always use php underscore self dot underscore server php underscore self okay so action if you want to submit so previously you have uh, done this right here here action is this right now you do what you do is dot underscore server <coughs> php underscore self okay echo so that that is what you are supposed to do so next time if you want to submit a file to self okay always use either dollar underscore server of php self or dollar underscore server server of script underscore file name okay remember this then the next request uri <coughs> okay whatever the url we are using here so which url are you are uh, uh, you are on current like you know whenever you want to say okay this is your current url that's what it says request your uri so this file uh, made us stay here so that's what request uri does a remote address is nothing but from which ip address does the client come from so sometimes you know people try to save the ip address to know which country they are coming from or which city they are coming from so remote address is used for that purpose any questions here okay so then uh, document underscore root why is this needed again why document underscore root now tomorrow you change the file to anywhere okay so anytime the file will be in document underscore root itself so you know if you see, instead of writing the complete path here you see this is the complete path tomorrow this may change yeah you can do geolocation too yes there are some libraries out there but nothing will give you exact thing no way you can get exact thing all you because the servers may be different places somebody may use proxy servers so don't trust them keep keep ip address i'll tell you why why ip address is needed 
it's not about location actually how do i use ip addresses if i if i want to use i only check if this guy is coming from the same system every time so when i say same system it's the same ip address so you get the same ip address the first six numbers of the ip address remain the same if you are doing from the same system again and again so how many times do, uh, you know does this person has come to my website again and again so that's where i use this ip address to track again you can get uh, the city location also city location not like you know you can get okay this guy is from from chennai this guy is coming from bangalore so that you can get again okay so request method you know request method this is used when so whenever you submit form when you don't know what the method it is you can check the method if request method is post then only process the form or else please don't process the form sometimes what happens i'll tell you uh, 